Hi there, uh, this is day 16, so it's been quite wet, quite rainy today. Um, although not enough that I haven't been able to uh, talk to people in the street, so I've done some of that. Um, I met this guy uh, who I'm going out with uh, and going into the street and we're working together today. Uh, Hi guys, how are you? Yeah, we were doing very well actually today. Uh, we did not do much approach, but we were very confident. That's right. Yeah, yeah. so um, Brad's been telling me about uh, how he goes to salsa events. So, yes. so what have you learned from going to salsa events? Yeah, uh, you learn to be like uh, very physical. You don't need to be uh, shy about your body or touching girls. That's natural. You can do it with anyone and that will reflect even uh, outside the salsa things. Yeah, so you can do that. Okay. Um, so, in terms of going into supermarkets, I actually met someone else here as well. I'm seeing people now all over the place. And um, he showed me how to, how to approach someone in the supermarket. He was very bold. Um, it was very impressive actually. He was very bold. He just walked straight up to them. Uh, and then uh, he just introduced himself, um, just talked about something that he was interested in. Um, he introduced me um, and then you know swap numbers the thing that got me about it was that he was so forward like way more forward than I've been so far um, and it's like initially they were trying to brush him off but he just he just kept going and uh, ended up swapping numbers with them so I was very impressed with that um, it, it made me think that I need to be a lot more forward especially when I'm in inside and actually inside doesn't really affect it doesn't really change it as much as you would think um, so I, I need to practice that a lot more for me the, the problem with it is that I don't know what to say at the moment and I need to get over that that barrier of what do I say uh, for some reason in the street it doesn't seem to be as much of an issue but I don't know. Okay, so um, Brad went home, so I decided to carry on on my own. And I feel like I've got a little bit more confidence now with with uh, being indoors and doing the approaching. Thanks to seeing you, you know who you are. Uh, you showed me uh, that it's not, uh, just the uh, same as being outside, it's just not difficult. So I, I just went into the supermarket and um, talked to someone. Um, and it was a great conversation. Uh, she was um, on the in the vegetarian section, so I just started talking about that, and uh, yeah, it was good. Uh, one thing that is really sticking out to me at the moment is um, I'm really getting stuck on having something to say. Now, I'm not really sure why that is at this point, um, but it seems to be emerging quite clearly. I'm wondering if I need to like brush up on some something to start with, but I kind of feel like I don't want to do that. I kind of feel like it wouldn't be authentic and I'd become like a robot. Um, something to keep note of anyway. <laughs> okay, so thoughts for the day. Um, it's been an interesting day today. I feel that I started off quite jittery. Um, my work is going well now. Um, my work life, I feel like I'm starting to get on top of it, which is a first. Um, and I felt like at the beginning I kind of rushed in to the space um, and I was thinking, oh, is, th is this going to be affected? Um, have I got the balance right? Um, I feel like it's coming. I feel like it's coming. I thought with the weather being quite rainy that I would have to change what I was doing and I've been looking at uh, doing evening classes um, but actually I don't think that's strictly necessary right now um, so I think one thing that seems to have stood out today is that I've not been on my own um, I've had people around me all day uh, which has been interesting it's been it's been fun I've enjoyed that um, I mean it's what I wanted so yeah, so see you tomorrow.